Unlocking the bootloader of your Android device now will prevent it from passing safety net checks unless you have installed a modification that bypasses those checks. So if you ever want to relock the bootloader of your OnePlus 5, you can follow these steps because that's what I'm going to show you how to do today. Now since you have previously unlocked the bootloader, I can skip a lot of the requirements in this video, but if you're confused on any of that, be sure to check the full tutorial below this video, as I'll have a link to all of the instructions that are needed for things like installing ADB, setting up your drivers, and all of that. So to start, we just need to boot the OnePlus 5 into bootloader mode, which is also known as fast boot mode. This is very similar to what we did in the previous tutorial on how to unlock the bootloader, but this time we're just going to execute a different command, a different fast boot command in our command prompt. So once we have the OnePlus 5 in fast boot mode or bootloader mode, we're going to connect it to our PC with a USB cable. We're going to make sure that the ADB service is running and we do that by executing the ADB devices command. And then we're going to type out fast boot space flashing space lock and then we just press enter on the keyboard and once we press enter on the keyboard we can look at our OnePlus 5 now and it's going to ask us if if we want to lock the bootloader just like we did when we unlocked it it gives you some information telling you that it will delete all of your personal data. So be aware of that. I'm going to press the volume up or volume down button until you highlight the yes option. And then we're just going to press the power button to select it. Now I do want to say it is advised that you be on as clean of a version of Android and Oxygen OS as possible whenever you lock the bootloader. It will do a factory reset but some modifications live through a factory reset and you're going to want to restore back to stock Android or go through some traditional unbrick guides which I will go through later just to make sure your version of Android is as clean and unmodified as possible before you go through and relock the bootloader. And just like when we unlocked the bootloader, it did a factory reset. So this first boot cycle is going to take a little bit longer than normal. And once it completes, it's just going to take us to the typical Android activation screen where we'll be instructed to set up our device again. And there you have it. That is how to relock the bootloader of the OnePlus 5. 